Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial we are going to find the parameter of this given shape. And let me remind you one thing that this shape is also called irregular polygon. And we all know the polygon means many sided shape. And one more thing this parameter could also be called the length of the boundary of this given shape. All right, so let's go ahead and get started to figure out the parameter. So let's focus on individual sides. So look at this individual side, which is six units. You can see that one. This individual side is six unit as well. This is nine units and this side you can easily figure out the total is 15 take away 6 is gonna be simply 9 units and this side is 6 units so the only thing we need to be concerned about we need to figure about figure out about this side which is a diagonal side and this side is as well and in this next step to make things easier I have created two right triangles you can see so we can figure out these unknown side so these are right triangles since their angle is obviously 90 degrees and now in this step since these are right triangles so we're going to be using Pythagorean theorem and Pythagorean theorem is simply c squared equal to a squared plus b squared we are always remember that c is going to be the longest leg and c is also called hypotenuse and let's go ahead and figure out over here let's focus on this top triangle right triangle so we're going to call this side a this side B and this is side C. So we're going to be applying this Pythagorean theorem, which is C squared equal to A square plus B square. So A in our case is 9 square plus 6 square. So that's going to become 81 plus 36 equal to. 117 c square now we wanna find c so we're gonna take the square root on both sides so c turns out to be a square root of 117 so thus we figured out this unknown side is 117 so likewise we're going to be finding the unknown side in this right triangle as well by using this pythagorean theorem so let's call this side a this side b and this unknown side is c so apply pythagorean theorem again c squared equal to a square plus b square a is 6 so 6 square plus 3 square so 36 plus 9 equals to 45 so c square turns out to be 45 so take the square root so c turns out to be square root of 45 so that means this unknown side turns out to be square root of 45 and in this final step let's go ahead and add up all these individual sides to find the parameter so this side is six units this is six units this is nine units this is nine unit as well this is just we figured out this square root of 45 this is six unit and finally this is square root of 117 so thus our parameter is going to be simply I want you to add them up so that's going to be simply 6 plus 6 plus 9 plus 9 plus square root of 45 
plus 6 and plus square root of 117. So let's add up these whole numbers first. So that's going to give you 36 plus square root of 45 plus square root of 117. And we know that uh, square root of 117 is approximately equal to 10.8 and square root of 45 is approximately equal to 6.7. Let's plug it in over here. So that's going to give 36 plus 6.7 plus 10.8. Let's add it up. So our parameter is going to be approximately equal to 53.5 units. And that is our answer. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.